This is such an amazing problem. We are given a circle and a right triangle whose area is 96 square units and the length of the hypotenuse is 20. It is given that the center of this circle lies on this side of the triangle somewhere here. Our job is to find the area of this circle. So, can you find it? At first glance, this problem looks impossible to solve. But don't worry. Math is like a mystery novel, which is confusing at first, but everything falls into place once you find the clues. We have this right triangle, so let us label its side length as x and y. So, what will be the area of this triangle? It will be x times y over 2, but it is also equal to 96. Therefore, x times y equals 96 times 2, or 192. Now, let us use our favorite right triangle theorem. x square plus y square equals 20 square or 400. Now, we will use these two famous equations to make the math simpler. First, consider this one. This is 400 and x times y is 192. So, we get x plus y whole square equals 400 plus 2 times 192 or 784. Thus, x plus y equals root of this or 28. Now consider this. So, we get x minus y whole square equals 400 minus 2 times 192 or 16. Thus, x minus y equals root of this or 4. Awesome. Now add both of them together to get 2 times x equals 32 or x equals 16. Then substitute it here to get y equals 28 minus x or 28 minus 16 or 12. That is simply amazing. Now, here comes the magic. Since this is the center of this circle, therefore if we extend this line on the opposite side, then we get this length also equal to 12. Now extend this line to make a diameter like this and label it as x. We can now use the chord chord power theorem here. Imagine two lines crossing inside a circle, making four pieces. The theorem says that if you multiply the lengths of the two parts of one line, it will equal the same kind of multiplication for the other line. Therefore, this length, or x times this piece's length, or 16, equals this piece, or 12 times this length, or 12 again. So, we get x equals 144 over 16 or 9. Excellent! Thus, the diameter of this circle equals x plus 16 or 9 plus 16 or 25. Now the area of the circle is equal to pi times diameter square over 4 or pi times 25 square or 625 over 4 or 156.25 pi. And that's it! This is our final answer. Isn't this super cool? So good!